They're so good. They're so, they're so, they're so good. They're so fun. Hey loves, what's up? Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. So happy to have you here. Today we're going to do a Fashion Nova haul. I am trying on, I ordered 10 pairs of jeans. I feel like I ended up with nine, but I had ordered 10 pairs of jeans. That was the whole thing is I was going to try on all jeans, um, but then I ended up being able to get some tops to go with them. I talk all the time about how I love Fashion Nova jeans. Fashion Nova did supply the clothing for this video, just so you guys know. Um, I am obsessed with their jeans. I am tall. I have a long torso. I love stretch. I love skinny jeans and I have a really hard time getting jeans to fit my body just because just the way I my body is I have thick calves. I've got big thighs. I've got a lower belly. I'm going to be difficult and I feel like a lot of jeans out there even sometimes at Fashion Nova they really do have that like hourglass fit and I am not. We're kind of a mini fridge over here. You know what I'm saying? A little bit square, a little bit apple. Um, and that's okay. It's just how my body is. But thank you to Fashion Nova because they create jeans that actually make me feel good. Most of these I did get in a 22 or a 3X. And I think I got 120. I normally get 20s, but then I don't know. Just lately, it's been a rough minute and I just feel more comfortable in the 22s these days. Plus, I feel like I used to get too like hung up on the size. And the way I am with my legs swelling and like I just would rather be comfortable. I would rather them be a little bit too big than a little bit too small. So I just went with the 22. I feel like I have too many thoughts about this, but let's go ahead and jump in and go through each outfit and each pair of jeans. And I will tell you what I think and what's worth your time, what to look for, how to pick the right jeans at Fashion Nova. Cause I know it can be overwhelming. They have so, so many jeans, but they really do have some great ones. I picked a bunch of new ones and a couple old favorites in this haul just to make sure that you've got some really great ones. And I could tell you what I really think about them. Um, but yeah, let's jump in. Jeans. I typically prefer skinny jeans, but I did get a little bit of a mix for you guys so you could find something that maybe you would really like. The first pair of jeans we tried on was a pair of flare jeans. Flare jeans are just not really my personal cup of tea. And I do have to say, I have noticed any pair of flare jeans that I've gotten from Fashion Nova run a little bit small. I did get these in a 22. These are the Valentina High Rise Flare Jeans in dark denim. Um, again, I got these in a 22 and they like just fit. They kind of felt like they had that smaller waistband, which again, some of the jeans at Fashion Nova do. I feel like a lot of their flare ones, I haven't tried a ton of flare, probably three pairs total, but every single one I've made sure to size up on and they always just fit. I mean, I do kind of just wear 22 most of the time now, but you know what I'm saying. And normally a 20, it's very rare that I get a size 20 from Fashion Nova and it doesn't fit. But I, I tend to get a 22 just in case, just because I want to be more comfortable, if that makes sense. But these, as far as flare jeans go, were pretty comfortable. I don't have any complaints about them. They are a little bit long. They are super stretchy, but again, they aren't my favorite, not only because it's not really my personal style. If you love flare though, girl, you do you. I just feel like I my legs are shorter. <laughs> I'm tall, but because my legs are shorter, I feel like if I have anything but a skinny jean or I do like boyfriend jeans. I am getting into boyfriend jeans, but like a flare, I just feel like it looks weird on my personal body. That's just me. Um, but if you're into them, this is actually a really solid pair and it's probably the favorite one that I've ever tried on of flare jeans. And that's saying something. They're comfy. They're cute. I think they are cute. I think they just on my body, they're just not, not, not my fave. If I put a side that I don't really love flare jeans, I would give them like a seven out of 10, just because the waistband isn't the most comfortable in the world. And they do run a little bit small. Just keep that in mind, order up if you want them. Or if you just want to feel like super snatched, then I guess you can get your true size. Everyone's different. Do what feels good to you. To me, they feel a little bit small, you know? Always read the reviews. I always check reviews. I always check the percent of stretch. I try and get high stretch ones. They do have a whole section of just like high stretch jeans and I normally try and get them out of there. I did get a lot of these out of the new arrivals though. And then I did try it on with this little sweater that I'm actually wearing it now. I think it's so cute. <clears throat> I've been seeing everyone wearing these cute little crop sweaters and I, I don't know. I normally just like don't go for it, but I was like, you know what? How cute is that going to be with a lot of these high-waisted Fashion Nova jeans? They all they all hit me at a good point, which is good. I love Fashion Nova for that. I love a high-waisted jean. So it's one of the tops that I got. Super comfortable. Um, even though it was the first one I tried on, I decided to put it back on because I love it that much. And I can't wait to go take some cute little fall pictures in this sweater. So this is definitely a win if you're looking for a cute little cardigan. Um, I'm just wearing it buttoned, like a little top, which I like that. It fits great like that. It's not pulling or anything. Yeah, it's a win. 
Okay, the next jeans we tried on are the Hannah High Rise jeans in the light blue wash in A3X. If you had asked me a year ago, a year ago, I would have said stay away from the 1X, 2X, 3X pants at Fashion Nova. When I first started working with Fashion Nova, I got a couple 3Xs and I remember one of them I got and it looked like it was like a size 16. Most of the 3Xs at Fashion Nova are technically a size 20. Some of them will say 20, 22. You just have to read the size chart, but generally it's a size 20. So out of all of the 3Xs that I tried on, and about 50% of these were 3Xs, this was probably my least favorite one. I feel like this haul started out a little bit rocky and it definitely gets better. I did not do that on purpose. I literally just laid the jeans out and just kind of grabbed a variety of colors and tried to do them like alternating so you could get like a black pair, a dark denim pair, a light denim pair, and like a mix of styles instead of doing, you know, all the colors together. That way maybe you can see more of a difference between them. Um, but these are super cute. They are light wash, so they are gonna show your belly a little bit more, but they were, once they were on, I did feel like pretty locked and loaded in them. So they were a snugger fit, um, but definitely not, they didn't feel tight, but it's just because they are a lighter denim, they're gonna look a little bit tighter, a little bit smaller. I love the distressing on them. I think that light denim is cute. I normally will just wear a longer top when I'm wearing light denim or something like that, just to kind of cover my belly, just cause some days I just don't want it out there. Some days it's cool, some days I'm like, hey, it's my belly, whatever. You know, we all have good days, we all have bad days. You can, it's, you know, self-love and body positivity, body neutrality can be a roller coaster, so. If that's something you're worried about, because a lot of you guys will say you don't like light denim because of that issue, um, but just wear a longer top if you want to try it. I don't know. I love wearing it with like big baggy sweaters. I feel like that's my favorite thing. All right. So the next pair of jeans we tried on was the survival of the fittest ripped boyfriend jeans. The only thing I didn't love about these was the... the bottoms of them were like a raw edge. They didn't have like your typical, you know, how there's like a seam around the bottom of jeans. I like that. I'm not really into the frayed, what is it? Like a frayed ankle, the frayed bottoms. Like I'm not really into it. So I just feel like it looks like just like they're not finished or something. That's just my personal thing. I probably should have realized that when I was looking at them, but that's okay. Um, what size did I get these in? I got these in a 22. They don't have as much stretch as the other ones. So that being said, I'm very glad I got the 22. I'll try and remember to link the pair from my last Fashion Nova haul. I'm so in love with them, you guys, but I kind of wish those ones I would have gotten into 20 just because now that I've worn them, they have stretched out a little bit and they just fall right down. <laughs> it drives me nuts, uh, but I still love them so much that I just like, I'll put up with it. Anyone else have a pair of jeans like that where you're like, I don't care. These are the most comfortable thing I've ever put on my life. Even if I got to keep pulling them up, like I just love them. That's my absolute favorite pair of boyfriend jeans I've ever found. But again, I think you should get your true size in that one. But this pair right now that we're talking about, I think getting a size up is a good thing. It didn't feel like there was a ton of extra room in it. It felt like it was a good fit. Um, and I feel like boyfriend jeans just should be a little bit bigger. I think that, you know, in mom jeans are so hard to fit. Does anyone else have that issue? I feel like if I get just regular skinny jeans, like my, my tried and true high waisted skinny jeans, I can get a 20. If I want them to be locked and loaded, I can get a 22 for a little bit of extra comfort. And like, no matter what, it's really pretty consistent. Um, but when it comes to mom jeans and flare jeans, like any other jeans, I don't know if I'm just like not hip to it yet. Or maybe I'm just like have tried skinny jeans so much that maybe there's more stretch in a lot of skinny jeans. That could totally be it because you need stretch in a lot of skinny jeans. Wow, I am overthinking this. But <laughs> I really like these. If you're looking for a pair like this and you like the raw edge, I would go for it. I think these are really good. I think these are good. I would say probably an eight out of 10 on these. I don't know, I like these. And I normally, like boyfriend jeans are, are a tough one for me, but I'm starting to like them more and more. So I think these are a win. I actually really like how they look on me too. I'm looking at the pictures of me wearing them and I do, I do like how they look. Again, they don't have as much stretch as the other ones, but you know, it's cool. These next ones, you guys, I'm pretty positive I've had these in a, in a past haul before. These are the drive to the ocean jeans. And honestly, now getting them, <laughs> I kind of wish that I would have gotten a size down in them. I got the 3X. I love them. Don't get me wrong. And they're actually going to be really comfortable. I'm sure once I wash them and wear them and stuff like that, it's going to be fine. They just have a lot of room around the belly. So if you have a larger belly like me, you need these. Plus, I just love a dark denim with distressing. I love a black distressed denim, especially in this time of year, going into fall, going 
going into spooky season. I'm honestly, if I decide to do a look with jeans in the spooky lookbook, I think these are going to be the winner because they are just so perfect. They're so comfy. They're so high-waisted. They honestly, they feel like they're a size 24, to be honest with you. Like, a large 22, a smaller 24 roughly. There's a lot of extra room in these. I do think that a 2X may have been pretty snug on my calves, but I do have larger calves for my size for a thousand time. So just keep that kind of in mind. I think if I didn't have larger calves, a 2X would have been perfect for me, um, which that's normally never the case. So these do run big for sure, which again is so nice to see that in a size 3X. And this isn't the only 3X in this haul that ran big. And I am truly a size 20, 22, so. They're so good. They're so, they're so, they're so good. They're so comfy. This pair of jeans is like one of the ones that it's just like, thank you, Fashion Nova. These are good. This is why you're known for jeans, you know? I did try on a bodysuit with these. And you guys, this bodysuit, how gorgeous is it? I doubt you're even going to be able to really tell, but it's got a little bit of glitter on those little appliques. And I didn't even think about it being see through all the way. I'll probably wear the tank cup underneath, um, but whatever. It's so cute. I don't even care. I love it. I love it so much. The only thing about this bodysuit that I don't absolutely love is that there isn't like you have to pull it over your head. And I've got a big noggin and I wear extensions and like I just got a lot going on on my head. I always have a full face of makeup, especially if I'm going to wear something like that that's a full face of makeup top let's get real so that's the only thing that's gonna bug me about it but it's gonna have to be one of those items that you're gonna have to just figure it out or put it on before you do your makeup and take it off after you take your makeup off something like that I just feel like that might be like a little bit make me a little bit claustrophobic to be honest with you it's so beautiful and I, I think I'm just gonna pair it with like a high-waisted skirt because it's definitely it's not long enough for my torso, which is okay. That's honestly a rare thing for Fashion Nova bodysuits. A lot of them, I would say probably eight out of 10 are perfect on me and I can fasten them if I want to or leave them unfastened. But I most of the time just leave all of mine unfastened even if they are long enough because it's just a comfort thing, a hassle thing. You know, when you have arthritis in your hands, like sometimes like hooking stuff and just, it just seems like a lot of trouble that's not really necessary. But I understand why people do want to fasten their bodysuits and they do want to keep them in place. But I don't live a very like um, social life. So I don't really, you know, right now a lot of people aren't going out. So, but I think with the right skirt, I'm going to absolutely love this. So uh, this is freaking gorgeous. Okay, you guys, the next jeans I tried on are the classic high waist skinny jeans. These are in a 3X. I think that these have been in any of my big Fashion Nova denim videos because it's just my favorite pair. I love these. If your body is shaped anything like mine, you're going to love these. Of course, if you love skinny jeans, they are so stretchy, so comfortable, but they also, it's so cool because they're so stretchy and comfortable, but they're also like snatched. Like they just hit me in the best spot. And anytime I wanna wear a crop top or anything like that, this is the pair of jeans I go to. They're not overly thick, they're not super thin. So it's like that nice in between that still gives you the comfort. And I feel like it kind of just like, again, I love the word locked and loaded because it's like, it just feels like, you know, I feel like my posture is gonna be good. I feel like I'm just like, I feel good in these jeans. A classic pair of like high-waisted dark indigo denim is like my go-to, it's my favorite. And this pair of jeans never misses, it never misses. I'm obsessed, you guys. I really didn't wanna put on jeans today. And because the start of this haul started a little bit rocky, <laughs> I was a little bit worried. I was a little bit worried, but girl, I'm obsessed, I'm obsessed, I'm obsessed. These are the best, these are the best. If you are thinking, I do have to say, sometimes the different washes fit differently. I haven't tried to get anything but the dark indigo because I know those are a win and they're the ones that I wear the most. So I always just go with the dark indigo, but I don't know about the other ones. It's been so long. I do think that they've gotten their sizing so much better than when I first started getting clothes. Cause I remember I got the classic high waist and like the light wash and they didn't fit. And I tried to get them in the dark one and then there was a mistake and they accidentally sent me a size zero or something like that on accident. So anyway, um, I love these jeans so, so much. And I tried it on with this little olive like cropped sweatshirt. I'm pretty sure I own this. <laughs> which I'm not surprised. It's fine. It's fine. It's probably somewhere. I don't know. It's fine. I love it though. It's so comfy. I love an oversized crop sweatshirt. I feel like they're so cute. And again, it's such a great thing to wear with like high-waisted denim and because I paired it with, like I would totally wear these two together. 
But yeah, I, I love this little sweatshirt. It's super comfy, great for around the house or running errands or whatever. And again, because I wear a lot of high-waisted denim, it just looks like a normal real top for me. Um, and it barely shows any belly if it does just like a tiny bit. So they do have this in multiple colors. A lot of Fashion Nova's tops and denim comes in multiple shades. So keep that in mind. If you see a pair of these and you don't like the wash, you might be able to find a different wash. Again, everything's linked down below. Okay, so the next pair of jeans I tried on are the New Perspective Ripped Slim Mom Jeans. I got these in a 22 again. Mom jeans just never, you know, they never, it's just a thing. They just never fit right on me. But these are so comfy. They actually have stretch. They don't have as much stretch as like the classic highway skinny jeans, but they definitely did have stretch. And they definitely had a little bit of extra room in them, which is nice. If I'm going to go for a boyfriend jean or a mom jean, I feel like just getting you know, your comfortable size, which might be a size up, is always just the best thing to do because it's just going to feel the best. And I think that these in a smaller size wouldn't have fit as nice as I wanted them to. Uh, but these are great. They're not quite as high-waisted as I would love them to be, but they're high-waisted enough. Like they, they hit me in a good spot. Fashion Nova does like some of their high-waisted is like other companies super high-waisted. They just, they're, if you've got a long torso, they are your friend. Um, but they have a bunch that are not high-waisted too. So they have so many jeans. I just go for the high-waisted because that's my body. That's what I prefer. Um, but they definitely have options for you if that's not your thing. Uh, so yeah, I love these. Super comfortable. I actually have a little bit of stretch. Yeah, these are definitely, definitely a win. Okay, so the next pair I tried on is the super high-waisted denim skinnies. So Fashion Nova has had this one just as long as I think that they've had the classic high-waist skinny jeans. These are like the super high-waist skinny jeans. They're a thinner material, so keep that in mind. These felt a little bit smaller in the waistband. So while I like these, they're not my absolute favorite in the world. Um, again, they are in a 3X, so it is the 1X, 2X, 3X situation, which can be a little bit unpredictable. Albeit, they have gotten so much better for the million time. I'm very excited about that because now when I see a pair of jeans that I want to try in a 3X, I'm not near as scared to try it now when for so long I literally just like wouldn't even like enter my mind. I was just like, um, um, nope, nope, nope. Unless I like knew, like if I had seen someone else try them on and they said that they ran true to size, then I would try it. But before I was like, not even going to touch it. Um, so I'm so glad. <laughs> I'm so glad that I tried them again because now it just like opens up the world of possibilities for jeans at Fashion Nova. So these are just very basic black. They have these in multiple colors. I do believe I've tried them in the denim and the light denim before and I liked those as well. Something about this pair, I don't know, it felt like the waist was just like a little bit smaller but I'm also, again, I'm PMSy and bloaty and gross today. Um, so maybe I'll like them better in a week or so. Uh, but they're okay. They're not my favorite. Again, I would say probably seven out of 10. Do you love them? any of the ones that I keep forgetting to rate? They're a 10 out of 10. Okay. So the ones that I don't love, I'll give a rating to you. Does that work? Is that okay? I'm really inconsistent with the rating. I'll try and put it on the screen. Why am I like this? Um, but yeah, anytime they get a new moto jacket, I just have to jump on it. I love Fashion Nova's jackets. Almost always they work for me, which is great. Any of the ones I can think of that didn't work, it's been a minute, but, and that's even with my larger arms. Cause you guys know it's hard when your arms are larger trying to find jackets that fit it's to go up a size or and it just it's just difficult because my arms are larger than my bust is smaller but i'm always really surprised with fashion nova's jackets and they have some really great moto jackets this is a really good one it's got little zippers on the sleeves if you I didn't even realize that till after I took it off. It probably would have made pushing them up even easier. But I love pushing up my sleeves with a denim jacket. I don't know why. I just love the look. It feels more mobile. I just feel less constricted when I do that. So this guy was definitely a winner. If you're looking for a good moto jacket, I really like this one. And I like how it's got the little belt on my body because I do have a long torso. It looks a little bit more cropped than it might on your body. Um, and I do think I could get it zipped, but I, I never wear them zipped. And it probably would be like a tight situation and when you zip it it's going to get shorter so I just didn't bother trying to zip it because I was like I'm never going to wear it that way anyway. Um, all right the next pair of jeans we tried on is the one and only size 20. They are the our favorite high-rise skinny jeans which I knew were a win. I knew the 20 would work which is so great. I got a little nervous. I got a little nervous you know because it's been a pair that is like a tried and true and I wanted to make sure I got it in this haul because it's such a good one and thankfully this one was a win. What color did I get it in the medium wash? Got it in the dark denim. Yeah, these are just a really solid pair of skinny jeans. Any of the ones that say like our favorite high rise skinny jeans, I think they might have our favorite different rises. I'm not 100% sure because I literally always am just like high rise, high rise, high rise. I love having my belly like strapped in. <laughs> um, but yeah, they're great. 
They're great. I have absolutely no complaints about these. They fit, I would say, definitely true to size. It was a nice, like, locked and loaded fit. I didn't feel like they were too tight by any means, but it was one of those, like, whoo, get into them. These are always good. I've tried this, just like the classic high waist skinny jean. I would probably say these two are my absolute favorites. These are definitely a good one in any wash. And then I did try it on with this sweater. I do believe this sweater is supposed to be with the tie in the back. I do end up flipping it, but I wanted to try it with the like crisscross thing in the front because I love a sweater like that. And the last one I tried on didn't work for me. It was too small um, in one of my last hauls. So I thought I would try this one like this. I, it must go in the back because I'm pretty sure I just ordered like a basic sweater. I was like, heck yeah, maroon sweater, down for it. I just want some more sweaters. Um, so I went for that and I forget that Fashion Nova does a lot of stuff on the back of sweaters, but I honestly feel like it's more comfortable with the twist in the front. I just do. So I love it. And I felt like it gave me enough coverage in the front where it was just like a little tiny peek to peek of the belly because a lot of them will be shorter and stuff like that. And I want just, I want a little more coverage. So I love this one this way, but you'll see it in just a minute, the opposite way. Um, it just felt weird. It just felt weird because my back was like cold <laughs> and I'm not one of those people that likes to like show my back. I don't know. I would show my upper belly before I'd show my back probably any day. Okay, so the next pair of jeans. We're getting down to the last few. Oh, Luna. We're getting down to the last few things. These are the Nervous Around You jeans. I got these in a 22. These are one of the few that were actually a little bit extra loose. So I would say go with your absolute true size or like the smaller size. A lot of us, I feel like, have like one or two sizes that we go in between. And I would say you're good probably either way. They're still really comfortable. These ones are the only ones that were a little bit short on me. Um, and I am I am a tall beam, but again, I do carry a lot of my height in my torso. So I don't know, take that, do whatever with that information that you want, but they were a little bit short on me, which is kind of a bummer because I absolutely love them. Absolutely love them. I love the wash. I love the distressing, everything about them. They are super cute. I love a dark denim that is like not just a black pair of jeans. You know, I love when there's like a little bit of texture, a little bit of color difference, like a dark gray. I feel like it's just so cute and a little bit different. You don't see it as often. Everyone has black jeans. Everyone has dark denim jeans, but like to get like a gray, I just love these. I think they're so cute. Uh, these hit in a really good place. They just kind of had a little bit of a butt gap thing going on. A 9.5 out of 10 only because they're a little bit short on me. But if we're talking about just the jeans in general for the average person, I would say a 10 out of 10. If you're a little bit shorter than me, you're probably gonna love these. All right, and the very last pair of jeans we tried on are the Too Much Booty Jeans. These are in a size 3X. These were another one of the 3Xs that actually ran a little bit big. I had the situation where when I put my hand in my pocket, it just goes whoop and starts to fall down. I think I even tried to show you in the try on, so hopefully you'll see that in a minute. But that being said, I absolutely love them. They were just like a little bit too big, which again, they're a 3X, so I didn't expect that to happen. Um, I don't know... I don't know if I'd want a 2X in these. I don't know if it'd be worth sizing down for. Maybe just because I feel like they're going to fall down and that just drives me nuts. Like I can handle if it's like a little bit when like, I don't know. I just have to wear it with the right thing. But these are so insanely comfortable. They are so cute. I really love these jeans and they're definitely a pair of jeans that I would go to on any given day. They're really great for the days because like, again, they do run a little bit big if you need a little bit of extra comfy jeans, but I feel like they're just so classic and go with so many things. Definitely a big staple for me. All right, loves. So that is everything for the Fashion Nova haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will leave everything linked down below. They're not affiliate links or anything. They just are for you <laughs> to make it easier for you. I have heard that it's a little bit more difficult to find the drop box, like for the description box on YouTube mobile now. I haven't gone to look myself, uh, but you just click the tiny little arrow. Now it doesn't even say anything. You just have to find the arrow and click down. I don't know why YouTube does this, but it's annoying. <laughs> um, so it is down there. I promise if you just look, there's a tiny arrow and you just click it and it'll give you the whole description box. Anyway, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Let me know what kind of Fashion Nova haul you want to see next. If you want me to try jeans from anywhere else, let me know. I'm not going to be as excited about it though because <laughs> Fashion Nova jeans are forever my favorite. Honestly, I literally, you guys know, if you see me anywhere else, even like anytime I go do an in the dressing room or anything like that, I'm always like outfit of the day, fashion over jeans. I live in them. I mean, I'm not in them right now because I'm sitting here filming. I'm in a pair of shorts, which you can't see. Um, but when I have to leave the house, it's always fashion over jeans. Unless I'm like, I don't even know the last time I didn't wear a pair of fashion over jeans out of the house. I'm going to be real with you. Um, in my real everyday running errands, doing whatever I need to do in life, I'm still... 
obsessed. Um, okay. I think for real, that's everything. Cause I feel like I'm rambling. I love you guys so much. I will talk to you soon. Okay. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> what am I trying to say? Um, the them for forever. Why is there a bug in here? Um, I so just look for the little down area. Ario. I've lost my mind.